Hello, hi, this is Leo again from Bongzhu Sola. And then today I'm going to show you the training of the uh, pair of the communication connection between the uh, Bongzhu Sola inverter and the Bongzhu Sola lithium battery. So we are going to use uh, uh, internet cable uh, inside the Bongzhu Sola lithium battery cartoon. We have a communication cable. This is a normal internet cable. And then the first part, we connect the CAN port of the uh, lithium battery. So the CAN port is uh, in, the, in the middle side of the, uh, of the, in the left side, left hand side of the uh, battery. So we connect the CAN port, CAN port. And then another one, we are going to connect the inverter BMS port. So uh, why not? Because uh, if you have only one inverter, if you have only one inverter, so that will be easy. You only to connect the only one inverter. But sometimes you may have uh, like uh, this system. You may have a uh, one, two, three. You will pair, you may pair it out two inverter or three inverter or even five, six, seven, eight inverter. So which inverter we should connect? the communication cable with. So why now I'm going to tell you, you should connect with the master. So master, which one is the master? You can check from the, uh, from the, from the LCD. So we go down the P, the P11, this one is the S2, that means the slave 2. So that is not the master. We check this one. So we check this one, P11. So you can see this one is the AO, AO is the A0. That means this one is the master. So we should connect the communication with the master. So we should come connect the communication port BMS. You can see here, there's a BMS port, right? We connect here. <coughs> so, and then for the setting, we push the enter. We choose the, the setting. So you can see number 38. Number 38. Now it's off BMS. We turn it on. We choose the on. Confirm. And then access. So how can we know is that the communication is okay? We can check the uh, details of from the battery. First, we go down also. Eleven, twelve. So we can see one of thirteen battery voltage, and then we can see the SOC of the battery, temperature of the battery. That means the uh, Right now, and then uh, the battery uh, charge cut off uh, voltage. So we can see many information of the battery. So that means uh, already very good communication from the LCD. And then we, we, can, we can have uh, one more test. If we take it off, if we take off the uh, communication cable, and then we wait for a few seconds, it should be uh, some alarm. So yeah, yes. Is there is uh, some alarm? 56, 56, that means the uh, loss of the communication. So we, we can put it again. Okay, now there is no alarm. So that means the communication is very good right now because we communicate with the uh, master inverter. So normally, the slave, that means the other inverter, we can also check the battery information. So we will see. Yes, we can see the battery uh, SOC also 56. So that means uh, even we connect the communication with the number one inverter, but from the other inverter, we can also see the information of uh, the battery. 56, everything is the same. So if we take off the communication cable, 
we take it off. Just now we saw the first inverter, there is the alarm, and then why not we're going to see the second inverter. Yeah, they, they, they are, there is the alarm also, 56. Number three also, number three inverter, you can see the number three inverter. They also have the alarms. So why now I'm going to try to show you, we connect the communication again with the number one inverter. So what happens? All inverter, low alarm. Well, all inverter can check the battery information. So that means that the three inverter is very good communicate with the lithium battery. So normally, most of the engineer, most of the installation people, they cannot figure out, they cannot find out uh, this problem. Because sometimes uh, they are confused if we have uh, many inverters, how can we communicate with the lithium battery? And then today, I already show you the Bongzhu Solar inverter and the Bongzhu Solar lithium battery. How we make the communicate? How we make the communication if we have a multiple inverters? Okay, so hope this video can help you. And thank you very much. Bye bye.